Hi guys, Jessica here. I have a review for you and I'm very excited about it. Um, I'm reviewing um, the first bind up, the first sweet bind up by Kate Tiernan, which includes the Book of Shadows, the Coven, and the Blood Witch. There are 14 books in one super edition in this series. This is the bind up of the first three stories. Um, I started this Thursday evening. I read 120 pages to start. The first book is 180 pages, the second book is 180 pages, and the second book is 200 pages. Um, so this is, you know, almost 600 pages. Um, I read that the next morning. I finished the first book, started into the second book. Last night I read more of the second book, and then today I finished the second book this morning and finished the third book. So I read this in like a day and a half or less. That's how good it is. Um, so this story is about a girl named Morgan Rowlands. She meets a boy named Cal and pretty much is sweeped into um, the Wiccan world. Now I haven't read anything about Wicca before so it was very interesting to read. Um, and I learned a lot. And pretty much Morgan finds out that she's a blood witch. And a blood witch is someone whose parents are both were both blood witches as well. And it's part of this ancient, how do they describe it? Ancient and powerful line of witches that came from Ireland. Um, so, of course, her family is very Catholic. So the, she finds a lot about her past. She finds she struggles to get acceptance with her family and deciding on her religion. Also has problems with her friends. Her friends create a coven and it creates some sort of drama on who's going to be in this coven and who's going to not be. And it's very captivating and very addicting. The characters are very well developed, including her sister. And her sister plays a pretty powerful role in the story. While I noticed most stories like this, the siblings or the family are kind of secondary. But in this story, her family is very important in how the story um continues. Uh, the plot is definitely a 5 out of 5. The covers, you know, it's very ancient. You know, you got like the pentacle star and stuff and you got a lot of, you know, this filigree and all this stuff. Um, so, I mean, the cover is pretty cool. What I like most is the font. Um, it's so easy to read. It just keeps you going because it's, it's sans serif font. You know, anything about graphics design, that means there's no feet. It's very, you could draw a line on the bottom of, you know, the, on any line of the page and besides the diary forms and it just makes the eye be able to read a lot better. So you will read faster depending on, um, obviously the font of a book, it will guide you a certain way. Um, so font, cover, characters, plot. Oh, writing. And the writing is phenomenal. This book is more than a 5 out of 5. I love this book so much. I really didn't expect to love this book or these three books as much as I did. It's phenomenal. If you have it on your to be read list, read it now. Um, it's very interesting. Like I said, I haven't read a lot about Wicca before. So I like that there was a different approach to the whole occult and, um, you know, fantasy like world, I guess you can say. So definitely check this out. I definitely need to get my hands on the next bind ups. I think there's a, the next one's a purple cover. And then I think there's another one that just came out. So that's the nine book. So there's still, you know, another few bind ups that will be coming out. Probably three, two more, 15 total, 15 books. So I am just dying to know what happens. I mean, this story is so captivating. It did remind me somewhat of Wicked One. Um, which is what? Legacy... No, wait. Is that Wicked 2? Legacy and Spellbound by Debbie... I mean, Nancy Holder. Um, I still have to read Wicked 2 and Resurrection of that series. But this, the way that the story was written in a lot... Because that's about witches, but it's more black magic. Um, but the way that the story was, it was really keeping you going. So... King Tiernan and Nancy Holder definitely have similar writing style and the fact that they don't want you to stop reading their book. So this is sweet. Definitely 5 out of 5 book. I advise that you check it out ASAP. And happy reading as always. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.